Hello, my name is Sridhar and I'm from India. In this video, I show you how to change settings in Apple Mail and Gmail web interface so that we can achieve well-synchronized emails across all the Macs as well as Gmail web interface. I have an iMac at work, another iMac at home, MacBook to use when I am away from home and office. I use Apple Mail heavily in my work. Not often, but sometimes I use Gmail web interface for sending email. When I do this, I don't see the sent email in my Apple Mail across all my Mac devices. Another problem was, whenever I deleted an email from Apple Mail, it was not deleted from Gmail web interface. One more problem was, when I archived something from Gmail web interface, I could never see or search for it in Apple Mail. Not a big deal, but one minor grievance was, there was this ugly looking Gmail in square brackets in the left side of the Apple Mail. After spending some time, I figured out solutions for all these problems. In Apple Mail Preferences, under Accounts tab, under the Mailbox Behaviors, we need to select some of these options. First one, don't select Store Draft Messages on the server. If you select this option, while you compose a message in Apple Mail, every few seconds a new draft would be created in the Gmail web interface. Second, select store sent mails on the server. Selecting this option gets me the sent mail across all messages, all Mac devices and also Gmail. Select store junk messages on the server. Reason is that Gmail takes care of junk messages automatically. We don't want Apple Mail deleting messages thinking that they are junk. I selected both options next to trash because I really don't like Gmail keeping the deleted emails under a label all mail. When I delete something from Apple Mail, I want the same action from Gmail. Gmail deletes messages from trash after 30 days even when we select never here. By selecting never, we get to have them at least for 30 days in the Gmail web interface. Finally, by typing Gmail in square brackets under advanced tab, for IMAP path prefix, just like shown here, we don't see Gmail in square brackets in the left pane of the Apple Mail. Finally, if I arch archived a message on Apple Mail, I would like to see it under a label archive in the Gmail. Bef save all the changes and close the preferences and here, select the drafts and then go to the mailbox menu there use this mailbox for select drafts do the same thing for sent use this mailbox for select sent and then trash use this mailbox for select trash finally right click on the menu bar select customize toolbar and this gives you this all the symbols select drag the archive button onto the menu bar i'm not going to do it here because i already did that and then go to the inbox and select a message and then try to archive it as soon as you archive you will see a folder archive in the left pane at the same time apple mail creates a label under the nested label gmail in square brackets in the gmail web interface Now, you don't see all the labels you used to see before doing all these changes. Don't panic. We need to change the, we need to make changes on the Gmail web interface as well. Once we do the changes, you will see all the labels here under the name Gmail. Go to the Gmail settings and labels and there make sure that show in imap is selected only for the system labels inbox send mail drafts and trash don't select it for all mail and then scroll down under the labels add gmail in square brackets slash before each and every label name whenever you create a new label make sure that you create something like gmail in square brackets forward slash and the label name or type the label name 
and select the nest label under and then select gmail what happens is by doing that all the labels end up under the gmail in square brackets label because of this this gmail in square brackets doesn't appear on the left pane of the apple mail finally whenever you try to archive a message instead of hitting the archive button on gmail web interface you move it to the label gmail slash archive then this appears in archive folder on, on apple mail archiving a message on apple mail puts it under gmail archive label in gmail this means i can see the message everywhere finally go to the option forwarding and pop imap here make sure that you select auto expunge off wait for the client to update the server and move the message to the trash for the option when a message is marked as deleted and expunged from the last visible IMAP folder. Save the changes, then restart the Apple Mail client. All these settings have been working great for me, especially when you delete a mail from the Apple Mail, it gets deleted in the Gmail web interface, and when I archive something in on the Apple Mail, it gets stored under the archive label in the Gmail and uh, the synchronization happens beautifully across all the devices and the Gmail. If you are confused about any of these settings, please let me know in the comments and I'll try to help you. And if you have any suggestions, please let me know. Thanks.